running back. Kelly takes the snap, and it'll be a jump throw wide open. Branson Schwabel, touchdown Southeaster. Kelly gets in on the action, finding Branson Schwabel. It's 14 to nothing Lions in the first quarter. The chance to get themselves back in the ball game. Third and five for Kelly. Wheel route to Marcus Cooper. He's got it, and he takes a shot and hey. Solid secondary, as we've seen tonight, but right there, Marlon Bridges just laying a giant hit down. Transferred here to Southeastern. As that one's complete to Jawan Petit Ferrer. Haven't called Petit Ferrer's name many times tonight, but he'll fall forward and have another. First down. Play action for Kelly. Looking long to the end zone. Wide open. Touchdown, Lions. The former walk on Austin Mitchell, possibly. The Lions are in business here in Hammond. And also, you see him, he's going under center now almost all, on all of these snaps that he has taken as a quarterback. Play action, and he finds his running back, Devontae Williams. Williams up the sideline. In Eastern, finally starting to move the ball. Finding a little bit of rhythm, getting out to the playmakers. And you see how Devontae Williams was kind of... In last week's game against SFA, this is a second down 10. Kelly distributes, finds his tight end. Schwabel slipping down near the sideline. 260 pounds, a couple blocking backs in front. Comes back to the right, open space, and a score! And Southeastern strikes first. Nice job of Cole Kelly being patient. He takes the snap, he lets the play develop, and he sees where the crease is on the right side. Great job after the loss. Kelly gonna put it in the air. Steps up, finds a man, and it's a first down. A gain of 13 yards as it's brought in by Devontae Williams. Two minutes into the second quarter, Southeastern already leading 7-0, looking for more. Lots of time. That's caught inside the five and staying on his feet. Out of 24. Boy lined up on the slot on the left-hand side, and you take a look here at the very end of the play. He gets pushed out just before going across to getting the ball. Still a second down and goal. Kelly fakes the pitch inside, and Kelly bashes his way for his second score. And the I don't think he has the word slide in his vocabulary. As he finds Williams on the edge. Williams with a seed down the sideline. Williams just pushed out. A margin this season. Kelly able to hold on to that one. Plenty of time on second down, and he finds the freshman, Ed McGee, for a first down into Central Arkansas territory. Leaves a third down and nine. Can Kelly pick it up? Kelly flushed slightly. Now he runs, falling forward. Doesn't have the first down. But what Frank Selfa wants this team to feel and be in, and no, and no moment is too big for him. A crossing route, complete down to the McGee. He stops right slot. Kelly goes to the air on the crossing route. And just a gain of a couple. A couple receivers either way. The six foot seven Kelly standing. All day. Firing. He has the first down. And turning away is Marquise Williams. All the way up by two touchdowns. Cole Kelly has dominated. Kelly looking to the front of the end zone and just shy of a score. And goal from just outside the one. Here's Kelly. Kelly driving. Kelly touchdown. Domination by the Lions. So we 
have been talking about the size and the strength of him. He just lumbers and turns his way and keeps pushing with those really thin right now. Don't miss those two guys. Defensive line depth even thinner now. It's Cole Kelly on the money. A couple. Let's take a look at the catch again. I like the way that Cole Kelly sets his feet. He's throwing catchable balls, and, and I'm not chasing Virgin. Virgil does not get the six in this one. Second down and eight. Swing pass, and again, getting Williams in space. That's exactly what Williams was able to do on that play. Kelly dumps it off, and again, it's Austin Mitchell. Mitchell to the edge. There is a flag down. Next to Greg Stevens as well. Cole Kelly puts it in the air. And oh, what a pass right up the sideline to Williams. Williams gets away from small and half. Receives a perfect pass. It's over the top of the defender. The defender is really less than half a stride away from Devon. He gets a pick. Cole Kelly's right back out there after the fumble. Throws his man open inside the 15. Javon Connor on one play. Uh, Javon Connor's been a handful in this game. He's an inside receiver, not a big guy, 5'10, about 170 pounds. They can score a first down without a touchdown. The out route, nice stop. Javon Connor down to the held that edge. Here's second and goal from the six. Puts it in the air and it's a touchdown. Javon Connor just inside the left pylon. Or by that offensive line, excuse me. And you see the time that Cole Kelly has to locate Javon Connor. And again, it was that little bunch set where he lined up and you see the crossing routes coming through. Pulling the defenders away in Connor's water. Marquee game of the week has been all Southeastern. Pass down the seam. Big catch by Schwabel. And he tries to run away. Schwabel all the way inside the 30 yard line. And he takes it down. A big catch and run. Continually impressed with how well Cole Kelly is throwing the ball and delivering it right over the top. And that 6 5 frame, obviously. Gino Garcia, he's 15 of 17 on the year with field goals. Cole Kelly, the junior, the 25-yard line. Williams in motion out of the backfield, and Kelly's going to try and swing a pass out to him. Has him open, completed, and he's out across midfield into Huskies territory, gain and a first down for the Lions. Devontae Williams coming out of the backfield wide open. No one really picked him up over there. And not only the first down, but many more all the way down. He stays out there quarterback on this fourth down play. He will drop to throw, swings it to the near sideline, and he's got Connor. It's complete inside the 20 at about the 17-yard line. Connor wide open in the corner here, makes the catch all the way to the 15. Kelly looks to throw. Has time across the middle, has a receiver. It's caught. That's Turner makes a catch. Turner is one of the leading receivers here for Southeastern. He's just a sophomore from La Paz, Louisiana. Got open in that little zone. Third down. He's going to keep it and take it forward inside the 20, down to about the 18. Abilene Christian on the road will be tough with their new facility. Kelly wants to throw. As a receiver, and again out of the backfield, go now. The ball is at the 21 yard line in HBU territory. And Kelly will look to throw down the field. Has a receiver caught, touchdown Southeastern. Third and eight. Four man rush and wide open over the middle is Schwabel, the big tight end, into Abilene Christian territory. Yards. A great job there by the pass again Wildcats in zone coverage I think Jeremiah Chambers didn't realize he was open to the left of him and a he's thrown for nine touchdowns this year with an interception goes over the middle and picking apart this zone coverage defense Kelly he's got this whole drive second and 13 quick hitter to the edge and Kelly's gonna keep it it's close. And now the quick hitter to the outside. Williams in space, avoids an ankle tackle. To fake it, throw it, it is caught, and it is a first down to the fullback, Damian Dawson. 
put the Lions in a successful position. Now Cole Kelly, the quarterback, he takes a shot down the middle, pass caught, running free. It's been a tight end type of day for Southeastern Louisiana. Brand Flag down on the play, we'll check that. As they find the big tight end down the middle. Great job by Kelly to compose himself to get that thrown, but let's see what the penalty is. Twist playing center field. It's Cole Kelly at quarterback, and he, the big fella, taking down SFA and then just shutting out Central Arkansas last week. Catch made on the outside. A two-game losing streak. They made some great adjustments. Coaching staff props to them and props to these players to sticking through that tough time and just Kelly dumps it off again. Good room to run. Really nice. And this, it's a gorgeous day. Second and eight. Kelly to the outside he goes. Change up at quarterback, Cole Kelly. He'll take about 25% of the snaps. He's in now, QB. Throws a strike for a first down. Caught by Williams. And that'll move the chains up to the 37-yard line. Saw a transfer. Yeah, and you bring him in because he's a heavy tendency to run the ball. But what they do is break that tendency and throw the slant to what I talked about was one of the most enough. Man. Play fake. Has some time. Delivers the pass on the money. It's Turner. First down across the 40. And tackled from behind by Dante Olsen at the 48. Field. And a good pass here. And they're running tempo. But watch them stand tall and rifle this ball downfield. And you see so often in college football, guys sort of bang guys down. No, no. Wrap up. Don't give me a bang. Kelly stops. He's got a man open. Flips it to the left side. Caught by Williams. And he backs into the end zone. Touchdown, Lions. He catches for the season. Well, this is all set up here by the play action, what they did well, as far as the run fake. Cole Kelly steps up into the line of scrimmage, and he steps back, then he just kind of winds up very easily and throws it out there. Here. Jones in motion to the right side. And the big quarterback gets rid of it. It is caught. This is a good combination route. He goes out of the backfield and then back angles to the post and goes back outside again. And the linebacker, Pittman, just cannot to start this series for Southeastern. He'll fake the jet sweep, take it right up the middle for three. Guys, a couple ACC mixed in there. Guys who played against the elite. Kelly's going to throw a wide open receiver. It's caught by Connor at midfield. Beat the coverage that time. A bit of a turf toe. We're told he's going to get 30 to 40 snaps in this game today. Only played 15 last weekend. They're in zone coverage. And the move inside nine minutes to go. Kelly pressure up the middle, avoids, slips right, throws across the middle. Schrable with his third catch, tackled by Amos, and another for Dylan Goodman here. He's, he comes across, it's almost like he takes the football and spins away from 25. Goodman, you'll see it right here. Goodman comes in and goes, whoop, thank you for that football. Excellent concentration and awareness by Schwabel. Their own 24-yard line. Yeah, we'll see Cole Kelly. Into the ball game, he'll take it on the quarterback keep. Just a little counter dotting the eye. Wing to the left. He'll motion Damian Dawson to the left side. He'll play fake. Rolling, dumps it out. He's got a man. That's Dawson, and he is stood up and close to a first down. Looks like he'll have it. Williams motions left side. Kelly to throw. Steps up, climbs the pocket. Now dumps it away. He's got C.J. Turner just on the check down. He'll have a first down, giving Kelly in the gun. Drop the throw, four-man rush. Flushed out of the pocket. Now dumps it away near side. That's Devontae's got it in the Lumberjack territory. Fights forward down to the left. Austin Mitchell split out to the left. Kelly to throw across the middle. He's got his tight end. That is Branson Schwabel, the senior out of A.M. Give him eight. Down to the 14. Devontae Williams motions far side. Kelly to throw has time across the middle. He's got a short uh, crosser. And that Kelly's going to keep the football in the zone keep. He's got some running room, dives forward, breaks the tackle, has the first down, and short man flank. Kelly wants to throw, dumps it out of the backfield. He's got Devontae, shakes a man into Lumberjack territory inside the 40. And Devontae Williams can to the right. Is Lorenzo Nunez. Kelly wants to throw, and it's uh, dug off the ground by Ed McGee. Is that a catch? The freshman pulled it off the ground. Kelly versus a four-man rush, has time, dumps it across the middle, it's caught. 
And the ball fumbled and picked up. I'll see if he was down. That was Marquise Williams. There's Swable flex to the right. Kelly wants to throw all out blitz. Out of the backfield. Touchdown. Wide open was Devontae Williams. Nobody picked him up.